trying to see who pistol thumping bullets light up the dark. Every time my body drop, it look like pieces of art. And with this chopper, paint the block up, nigga, call me Bob Ross. Hey, I'm who they want to be, or maybe the old me. New with me, just ride the beat, boy, Jack got the best of me. Alright, y'all, today we here reacting to the most expensive cars owned by NBA players. Uh, I told you we was going to get back to doing, you know, something more sports related. We're going to go ahead and get right into it. I ain't going to do a lot of talking. So let's go ahead and get it started. A handful are able to play in college or European leagues, but a minuscule fraction actually make it to the NBA. However, once you're in this elite class, you're rewarded handsomely. The average NBA player takes home nearly $8 million every season. With this kind of spending money, NBA players treat themselves to some of the most luxurious vehicles on the road. Today, we are looking at the cars of NBA players. Link for the video is going to be in the description, too. Of course, it's a contentious subject, but many people consider LeBron James to be the greatest basketball player of his generation. His accomplishments include three NBA championships. Stop. Not even finna get into that right now. Tips, four NBA Most Valuable Player Awards, three NBA Finals MVP Awards, and two Olympic gold medals. With three NBA champions. I respect him, though. I respect him. Don't think I don't respect LeBron. But he not to go. Championships under his belt, he's accumulated over $400 million. In return, the greatest rides in the world sit in his garage. For instance, LeBron James spent around $670,000 on a Lamborghini Aventador that was later on customized with a color scheme that's identical with his Nike LeBron. Come on, LeBron. I ain't finna lie, that motherfucker. Ugly as hell, and ain't even mean to curse like that. It's ugly. And you did it to match your shoes. And LeBron's shoes ugly as, ugly as hell to me. Like, they, they are the ugliest basketball shoes on the planet to me. I'm sorry. You know, I'm sorry. But that car ugly. Like, the color scheme, that's ugly. Them shoes, ugly as hell. LeBron XI and King James Legacy sneakers. This car hides the mighty 6.5 liter V12 engine, thus making it one of the fastest supercars ever produced. In addition, he owns a Porsche 911 Turbo S. That look better than that. There are many pictures of LeBron driving this car, so we know it's one of his favorites. The 911 Turbo S costs a whopping $161,800, whereas other Porsches average around $60,000 to $80,000. Mm. It completes the 0 to 60 in a head spinning 2.9 seconds. LeBron loves Porsche's cars so much that he bought a Porsche Panamera for his mother, which isn't a bad choice considering the Super Sedan is a fan favorite. LeBron definitely appreciates some of the iconic American cars, and his garage hides the 1975 Chevrolet Impala. This is a fully restored and custom-made Chevy with massive wheels. The classic muscle car has been supercharged with a brand new... Of course. You gotta get one of those. I even want me one of those once I get some decent amount of bread. I want, I want me like an old school. So I understand why you got that, you know. I think that's probably the best looking car so far. I mean, you know, the Porsche look good. It's just all black. But I mean, that look better than that Lamborghini color scheme, whatever he, what up, bruh. New engine. Apparently, James often forgets about his cars because he has so many. A sensation that few people on earth can relate to. We're used to seeing Derrick Rose speeding past defenders and driving to the net. But catching a glimpse of him behind the wheel of one of his luxury cars is another story. His first big purchase after signing his rookie contract was a Maserati Gran Turismo. It set him okay. back around $110,000, but for Rose, it was just the beginning. For a while, he owned a Bentley Mulsanne. The car runs about $300,000 for the base model and offers luxury and high performance all wrapped up in one sleek vehicle. Unfortunately, Rose got into an accident in 2012 that effectively totaled the car. But for him, this was just a bump in the road. The crown jewel of Rose's collection mm. must be his Bugatti Veyron. Considered by many to be the mm. most impressive sports car ever built, these vehicles cost at least $1.7 million. Mm. 1.7? D Rose said, I'm finna go crazy. I got the money, I'm finna go crazy. That motherfucker look nice too. Sorry for the cursing, but that look nice. And set the land speed record for a commercially available car when it was released. During the winter months, the hometown star would reportedly opt for the more practical Ford F 450 truck. This was simply a matter of safety when driving around Chicago in the snow. The Ford handles much better than most of the sports cars in his armada. Sometimes it takes a practical car to round out your fleet. Okay. 
Many athletes own a series of impressive sports cars, but very few have the kind of super vehicles that Dwight Howard owns. The 33-year-old was the first draft pick back in 2004, and his salary has reflected his all-star status. After just a few seasons, he shelled out for the Knight XV truck, worth well over $600,000. The most impressive... I ain't never seen that truck before. Even, that was the first time I ever heard of it. ...impressive of Dwight Howard's cars. The ultra-luxurious, handcrafted, fully armored SUV is only one of 100 manufactured. Built for the overly cautious millionaire, the Knight XV is capable of withstanding an attack by a small army. The engineers at night went as far as posting a ballistic test chart specifying in detail the vehicle's body armor resistance to various types of ammunition. Dwight Howard is worth a healthy $100 million, earning $21.4 million annually, making the $620,000 price tag for the Knight XV affordable. And bear in mind, this is just one of Howard's many rides. He also boasts a Bentley Mulzahn, specially fitted to accommodate his 611 frame. He also had it fitted with 4G connectivity to allow the passengers to watch TV, play video games, and stream media on the go. Dwayne Wade was the fifth 2003 NBA draft pick by the Miami Heat. Since then, he played with the Heat until 2016. After two seasons at different teams, he's right back where he started in Miami. The Marquette University student skipped his senior year. This video is a year old, so we all know Dwayne Wade retired. ...year to enter the NBA and has had unprecedented success ever since. The established veteran is no stranger to sleek vehicles, and he owns not one, but two McLarens. Mm. His first, the SLR McLaren, goes for about $1.5 million and can mm. race from 0 to 60 miles per hour in less than four seconds. Apparently, Wade was not content with just one because he picked up a McLaren MP412C later in his career. Only produced for three years, this sports car is extremely rare and highly valued among collectors. The car makes use of Formula One source technologies such as brake steer, where the inside rear wheel is braked during fast cornering to reduce understeer. Power is transmitted to the wheels through a seven-speed dual-clutch transmission manufactured by SSG. The entire drivetrain is the first to be entirely designed and produced in-house by McLaren. Essentially, the car recreates the experience of high-octane racing, yet it remains street legal. And of course, Wade has many more cars, including a Ferrari F12 Berlinetta, which generally goes for half a million dollars. Born on November 12, 1988 in Long Beach, California, Russell Westbrook learned to play basketball from his hoops-loving father. He led his team to the 2012 NBA Finals and was named MVP in 2017 after becoming the first player in 55 years to average a triple-double for the entire season. Also known for his eccentric outfits, Westbrook has collaborated with Barney's New York and launched an eyewear brand. He's worth an estimated $125 million, leaving plenty left over for luxury cars. Perhaps most impressive is the Lamborghini Aventador, worth $387,000. Also called the Fighting Bull, the Aventador packs some serious punch and is one of the sleekest sports cars ever built. But Westbrook was not content to own just one car, and as he approached retirement, he wanted a side hustle to keep him going. That's why Westbrook opened his own car dealership in California in 2016. He opened a dealership that sells Chrysler, Dodge, Jeep, and Ram brand cars with his name attached to it in Van Nuys, California. Apparently, after only a few years, business is booming, allowing Westbrook to retire comfortably. Hmm. That's smart, though. Currently playing for the Golden State Warriors, Kevin Durant put in most of his time with the Seattle Supersonics and the Oklahoma City Thunder. As a professional, he's won two NBA championships, an NBA Most Valuable Player Award, two Finals MVP Awards, two NBA All-Star Game Most Valuable Player Awards, four NBA Scoring Titles, the NBA Rookie of the Year Award, and two Olympic Gold Medals. Off the court, Duran is one of the highest-earning basketball players in the world, due in part to endorsement deals with companies such as Foot Locker and Nike. In recent years, he's contributed to the Players' Tribune as both a photographer and writer. All this contributes to a whopping $170 million net worth, and quite a bit of his value is tied up in cars. When riding around the city, Durant usually opts for his Mercedes G-Wagon. Though it only costs $200,000, this car is still meant to exude elegance. First produced in West Germany in the 1970s, this is one of the oldest models on Mercedes' roster. Durant also rocks the classic Ferrari California, a cherry red sports car that fits the definition of sleek design. This car also goes for two hundred thousand dollars. Mm. Durant, they, he ain't really go for no super duper expensive cars. You know, they 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 good. They look good. You know, not the best one I seen on here though. Michael Beasley has played for teams like the Miami Heat, Minnesota Timberwolves, Phoenix Suns, Shanghai Sharks, Shandong Golden Stars, Houston Rockets, Milwaukee Bucks, and New York Knicks. As a power forward, Michael Beasley reportedly earns around three point five million as his yearly salary from the LA Lakers. 
Further, Michael Beasley has an estimated net worth of over $10 million, with more than $30 million in career earnings. He's also notoriously flashy with his wealth. 9. Beasley said when asked how many cars he bought during his rookie season, All I knew was I've got a lot of money and I want a lot of things. I had a fixation on cars. I'm not even gonna lie to you. One of the crowns of this collection, a Bentley Continental Flying Spur, valued at $200,000, is one of his most prized possessions. This British-built luxury car is meant to mimic a horse-drawn carriage and exemplifies high living. However, in recent years, Beasley has downsized significantly. When asked how many cars he owns, he answered, One, a Tahoe, Beasley said. I've got priorities. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, man, that man sold every other car. He said that is not the lifestyle anymore. Tell me some priorities. You just went broke. That's tough. You for to invest that money, man. Back then, I didn't have any responsibilities. It was easy to spend the money. To learn the value of a dollar, you have to spend one. I didn't know the value of a dollar back then. Renowned for his shooting accuracy, pro basketball player Steph Curry of the Golden State Warriors was the first person to be named most valuable player by unanimous vote in NBA history. As of 2019, Steph Curry has a reported net worth of $90 million. In 2012, Curry signed a four-year contract extension with the Golden State Warriors. Curry's $12.1 million yearly salary made him just the 85th highest paid player in the NBA in the 2016-17 season, despite his two-time MVP status. So it comes as no surprise that Curry has a veritable fleet of high-end cars, starting with his classic Cadillac Escalade. The car has become synonymous with wealthy rappers and ballers and serves as the foundation for the rest of his fleet. Another cheaper car in his collection is a Kia Sorento. Each NBA MVP receives a Kia as part of the prize, and Steph Curry won a 2016 Sorento for his 2014-15 MVP season. He didn't keep it for long. According to The Drive, he immediately donated the car to the- You know he ain't want that. Come on, bro. Y'all know he ain't want that. He was going to get rid of that immediately. East Oakland Youth Development Center. On the more expensive end, he owns a Porsche 911 GT3 RS. This might not be the most expensive vehicle in Steph Curry's car collection, but it still might be the crown jewel. Besides its sleek yet muscular looks, the 500 horsepower goes from 0 to 60 miles per hour in just 3.1 seconds and hits a top speed of 193 miles per hour. Luxury SUVs have a special place in Steph Curry's car collection. We know he owns a tricked out Mercedes G55, and he also has a Range Rover Sport with a long wheelbase in the garage. The car costs close to $210,000 dollars from the dealer but we know curry's cost a lot more than that since he took his white model for some post factory modifications including custom 22 inch wheels mm. currently playing for the detroit pistons blake griffin started his career with nine seasons on the la clippers in his debut season he was selected as an all-star won the nba slam dunk contest and was named the nba rookie of the year he's only 30 years old but he's amassed a net worth of more than 60 million dollars his annual salary is $17 million, meaning that if he's wise with his cash, that net worth will continue to grow for many seasons. The crown of his automobile empire is a Tesla Model S. The car is both sleek and environmentally milder than a gas-guzzling Escalator Hummer. The Model S runs at about 80... He just pushed his handle out? That's tough. $5,000, but still stands as a standard for impressive handling and futuristic design. NBA guard James Harden, known as The Beard, has emerged as one of pro basketball's top players since his trade to the Houston Rockets in 2012. Basketball star James Harden is known as much for his prominent beard as he is for his stellar play. The number three pick in the 2009 NBA draft, he began his career with the Oklahoma City Thunder before a stunning trade to the Houston Rockets in 2012. Harden has since emerged as a perennial MVP candidate, thanks in part to the sort of play that produced a record-setting 60-point triple-double in January 2018. Renowned for his personal style both on and off the court, Harden rocks a Rolls-Royce Ghost. Mm. The pure white car is not flashy, but its simple elegance speaks volumes. When going on game day, the Rockets superstar said in an interview that he is in his Bentley Bentayga, but is quick to add that he's driving within the speed limit, as the car maxes out at 187 miles per hour. 187 miles per hour? Yeah, that, you, you had to get it for the white car. That's slow and you paying all that money for that car oh that's it well i hope y'all enjoyed the video um i don't who who had the best looking car though i gotta give it to derrick rose that bugatti that's tough that's tough
But um, I'm going to go ahead and get up out of here. Hope y'all enjoyed the video. Like I said, I will be back with sports analysis. Uh, I will be just like have some of the background, put the stuff up for y'all. Like it'll just be like that type of thing. So I'll be talking and conversating, all type of things. Uh, if have any other questions or any other videos y'all want me to react to, anything y'all want me to do, leave it down in the comment section below. This video link will be in the description. Your boy out.